Hey guys, today we're going to take a look at how you set up and use the gift card module inside the mobile app platform. Uh, so it's in your back office under the features tab here. Uh, you'll see gift cards and gift card settings. I've clicked on settings first. Uh, the settings where you manipulate the colors on the gift card screens inside of the app. Background color, text color, button color. This is all pretty straightforward. Um, you're able to change the language here. So if you don't want to say load wallet, you could say, you know, buy gift cards, whatever you want. Uh, this tab, uh, this field here is for adding your uh, the email IDs of your staff who are able to take funds out of the gift cards of your clients. So whoever's email IDs are entered here, will be able to remove, uh, have a, um, a tab in the app that, they, that only they would see that would enable them to pull up a QR code scanner and they'd be able to scan the QR codes of your customers and remove uh, dollars. Um, the tip line here is if you check this box, the customers will be prompted to uh, give a tip if, uh, if uh, it was checked. And I'll show you how that looks inside the screen. Um, and then you've got obviously some search criteria of all the gift cards that have been purchased. Um, coming from that to the actual gift card module, uh, this is the merchant panel. Uh, right here is where you manage the gift cards. You can manage your cards. You can see all the cards that you've got for sale. Uh, and then you can also um, add a gift card. Okay, so we're going to add a gift card here. Basic information, the name, merchant name, rebate percentage. Don't worry about this at this point. We are releasing a new feature and we'll explain that to you a little bit later. SKU number, vendor code, this could be the same thing. This is just ways for you to identify the gift card. PayPal ID, um, you could have individual gift cards with different PayPal IDs. Uh, great for an, uh, uh, an app if you're making a kind of a coupon app or whatever and you want to uh, grab a bunch of local merchants and, and get their gift cards, you could actually set up their gift cards in here and have the transactions paid directly to them when a transaction is made. So this would be if you, you know, sold uh, Shop A's gift card uh, and Shop B's gift card, they'd have different PayPal IDs and when someone buys Shop A's card, the money will go straight to them. Okay, description, pretty straightforward. Terms and conditions, straightforward. You're able to add an image for the gift card, uh, the name for the gift card as well as here, you know, like a $100 card, I'd call it a $100 card. Um, purchase price, this is the price that your consumer pays you for the gift card. And this is the value of the card. So you can actually sell a $100 card for $90 giving your consumers an incentive to buy gift cards, okay? Um, you could also sell, you know, sell a $100 card for $100. It's totally up to you guys. So that's the way you add a gift card. Over here is where you manage uh, your PayPal. Uh, Stripe, we're connected to Stripe and PayPal. If you've got Stripe um, or PayPal, just hit the Manage button. Your PayPal account will be here. You can edit it there, or you can add PayPal setup here. Uh, similarly, obviously, one or the other, you're going to be using Stripe or PayPal. Um, here's where you can add your logo or manage your logo. Uh, slider, we have sliders, and I'll show you the screens where you, uh, in a second uh, where you'll see the slider images going through. Uh, email templates, this is for, for when people forget their password. Um, you can set up an email template here and just uh, you know, put some language in there that, and it will automatically send them a password when they've forgotten their password. Um, and uh, the SMTP is for uh, sending emails. Um, customers. This is a list of all the customers, all the people that have purchased gift cards uh, from your business. Order details. These are the orders. There's nothing in this list right now. You can uh, actually, there should be. Uh, you can see purchase gift cards. No, we haven't sold any of this. Uh, redeemed gift cards. So here's the redeemed gift cards, um, all managed here. Uh, categories, you're able to set up different kind of categories. So when I go to manage categories, there's nothing here. Um, if you have, you know, hair salons or uh, you know, restaurants, whatever, you have different types of categories for your gift cards as well. Um, beneficiaries, this is coming soon. Don't worry about this at this point. Campaigns coming soon and then the reporting section. All of these three things are tied to a, uh, a rebate module that we're working on and will be released very soon. Um, and that's essentially it as far as how you set it up. Now we'll take a look at what it looks like inside the app. All right, so here's uh, one of the apps that we've got gift cards in. I click on the gift card uh, tab there and it takes me to this section. We've got three screens here, the scan button. So this is the customer's QR code. So each customer inside the app will have their own unique uh, QR code that identifies them. Uh, and this is what your um, your staff would scan in order to take funds out of the gift card. Uh, the wallet section shows you um, what, where, what you've purchased and what you've used and your balance, obviously. And your gift cards would be managed here as well. So we've got uh, the local brands, which will, which will be pretty much what you're, you guys are going to be using the national brand board. We'll talk about it a little bit later, but I've got no transactional history in this, in this account. So there's nothing showing here. Uh, coming back to the scan tab. This is the first screen that you see when you uh, click on the gift card tab. This is how you buy gift cards. So you would click on the load wallet and you can change all that, the color scheme, all that kind of stuff can be changed. 
Uh, this is the slider image that we were just talking about a few seconds ago. You can have um, different sliders. I think we've only got the one here, but you can have different sliders going through here. Okay. Um, and these are all the lists of all the different gift cards that we are selling for this specific business. All right. So very, uh, you know, nice UI. Uh, you're able to favorite your cards. You're able to purchase, you know, purchase cards for yourself, uh, or you can buy them for somebody else. And you can share the card. So this is a fifty dollar card. I want to buy for myself. Buy for somebody else. I'm able to do that as well. Um, and uh, you've got your ability to go back here. And again, like I said, you can add more cards to a to a um, a purchase. So all of this stuff is done inside of the app. And um, again, when a merchant wants to redeem a card, the admin would scan the QR code and pull money right out of the card. Okay, so I'm just uh, I've just pulled out a second device and I've scanned the QR code. Now you can't see the second device; it's just asking me. Uh, I'm acting as the merchant on that device and it's asking me how much it spent. So I've got nine hundred dollars available here, and I'm just going to take out a hundred dollars from this account. I'm entering the hundred dollars, and now you can see the screen that comes up as soon as I enter the, the transaction amount. This is what the customer sees. It's also, it's it's better than a like a, a Visa terminal where you actually swipe your credit card. Uh, it's quicker. So I can enter an amount here. If I want to give a tip, I can give a percentage tip, uh, whatever I want. As soon as I hit the accept button, it's done. The money's out of my account and the merchant on his screen sees a, an approved sign. So it's really that quick. Uh, this is, there they go, my balance has been taken out. If I go to the wallet section, it will show me I've spent today. So this is a really, really great tool. Uh, well, um, you know, well worth any, uh, uh, worth it for any business that's going to be getting it. Um, and again, um, easy to set up, easy to use as you can, as you can see. Thanks for watching.